I'm Todd, and I'm here today to talk to you about the important role that food plays in people's lives. You might not realize it, but since the dawn of time, food has been all around us. <coughs> Apparently, food is essential for nutrition and well-being. But did you know that food is not just for the healthy? Apparently, patients in hospitals and residential care facilities also need food. I know, I was surprised when they told me. But that's why we need you. Science tells us that the food you prepare and serve helps make people better and helps stop malnutrition. Malnutrition occurs when a patient doesn't eat enough energy or protein. Outcome is that they lose weight without trying and can get weaker. That often means they have to spend longer in hospital than they otherwise would. And that's something none of us wants. <laughs> food is treatment too. Therefore, to provide the care that our patients need, your skill, expertise and all-round brilliance in food preparation plays a vital role in building the foundation for the holistic well-being of the patient. From the stove to the stomach, from the pot to the patient, Let's take these tips to the floor as we hunt down hunger and fight malnutrition together. In a hospital like yours, food is prepared somewhere. And this is where our journey begins. The actual origins of food go back to something called seeds. But for the purposes of our story, we'll skip all the boring bits and begin somewhere about here. One of the components in ensuring that food is eaten is the way it's presented. Scientists say that if food looks good, then we form an inseparable attraction to it. For example, just look at the way this bee is attracted to this flower. Beautiful, isn't it? Undeniable proof that if food served to a patient looks good, they're more likely to eat it, holding off potential malnutrition. But sometimes the harmony of the universe is disrupted and things don't go exactly according to plan. That's not what we want to see. As you know, when preparing food, it's important to ensure that your trays are evenly spaced. Having the trays too close together can lead to the presentation of unsightly food. When plating, food served on top of other food can also look unsightly and may result in a patient not eating. Ensuring that food you serve is presentable and attractive means that patients are more likely to want to eat it. Nutrition is the road to recovery and food is a vital part of that recovery. The way you present food can make a big difference. Food is treatment too. Mmm, now that looks appealing and nutritional. I can't think of a better treatment for a patient and I should know I once played a patient on TV. When placing food by the bedside, it's important to make sure that the tray table is within easy reach of the patient. A recent study involving scientific data has shown that if a patient can actually reach their food, they have a much greater chance of eating it. I say, madam, I see that your food is close to you and that you can reach it. How does that make you feel? Oh, it's so good, dear. I love it that it's within reach and that I can eat it. But what happens if I move your food to say... Here. Well, I'll... That's right. You can't reach it and we always want to be able to reach our food. Likewise, if you can't take food to the patient for whatever reason, tell someone who looks official and important. I say, you there, nurse.
Nutrition is important. Patients need to eat in order to remain healthy. Food plays an important part on the road to recovery. Sometimes you'll notice that a patient hasn't eaten, and this can be for a variety of reasons. If you do notice that a patient hasn't eaten their food, it's important to tell someone who cares, or who should care. They can then monitor the patient and their eating habits to make sure they have a healthy nutritional balance. Hey, sleeping man! Do you realize they've just taken your lunch away? Have you bought me my lunch? No, sleeping man. Your lunch has vanished. Now I imagine you're hungry and there's no food for you to eat. Poor, hungry, sleeping man. Nutrition is an important part of both the patient's general well-being and their recovery. If you notice that a patient hasn't eaten, it's important to tell someone who cares. There's one now. Likewise, if your patient is still eating when you come to collect the tray, give them just a little more time to eat and let someone know. Patient care is everyone's responsibility. We all value the importance of nutrition and how it impacts on the holistic well-being of the patient. Your role in this process cannot be underestimated. Remember, food is a part of treatment too.